What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft series uh, and you've been uh, asking me for more videos of Minecraft and such and I thought I'll give you a little bit of a tour of the newest editions of home base. I don't have that much time on my hands at the moment so it's just gonna be a, a bit of a shorter episode and hopefully uh, the next string of episode that I'm planning to do uh, I'm gonna go take a hike somewhere and see where I end up. I'm probably gonna go to you know, maybe cross the sea somewhere. Uh, I'm not sure what direction I'm gonna head. I think I'm gonna head this direction, past my water tower, and just keep heading that way and see where I end up. But uh, for now, there's not many new additions. But as you can see, this first tower here is no longer cobblestone. It's completely renovated now. It's all in half steps. All the floors are in half steps. All the walls are in half steps. Same with the passageway between the two towers. All in half steps. Roof, flooring, and both the walls are half steps. And this tower is the only one that remains now, which is uh, pure cobblestone. And it's gonna get wrecked down and remade in uh, half steps as well. I just ran out of resources as usual, uh, since half steps use up so much cobblestone and I have to burn it in the furnace to make smooth stone and then I have to convert it and basically when you convert smooth stone to cobble uh, to half steps you lose half of your resources but I also finished up this tunnel here so it's now all half steps and you can you can go take a quicker look at this tower here before it stood on a dirt plateau it's still standing on dirt as you can see but before the dirt went up maybe two three blocks up which was just pure dirt if you remember the earlier episodes i posted when i started uh, building this you tower poked. here uh, i i flatted out the ground here with just dirt because i wanted the the 10 by 10 or whatever how large that tower is i can't remember right now so i got rid of that dirt so now it looks more like the tower is you know, it just looks better somehow. The tower is inside the dirt hill. It's not standing on top of the dirt hill. So it, there's, it looks like it has a better foundation. But as you can see, it's all half steps. I really, I really like half steps. I can't get, I can't get enough of them. Also, uh, on top of that, let's go down here. Uh, I finally moved my bridge. This took only destroying the old bridge took an hour, and then rebuilding it uh, in a different way. As you can see, I'm keeping with the theme here, with the wood on the left and right, and uh, half steps in the middle. And I kept the fires on the sides, both sides. I extended the bridge with one step, so now it's four instead of three. Because I wanted to keep with the theme of all the passageways here. And uh, it goes all the way now to my, to my, other, to my new spawn point, uh, due to my game crashing a couple of months ago. Uh, this tower is still uh, in progress. I haven't added anything to it yet But we can go take a walk all over this bridge here and As you see there's half steps on the sides and wood and half steps in the middle and the fire from the nether rack That's the stone from the nether Which is always when set ablaze it will always burn forever It never douses like tree trunks or wooden planks that goes out after a while but before the old bridge was uh, three or four blocks to the left of this so it ended on this small island but my spawn point is actually over here in, on the mainland so now it goes all the way over to my new spawn point and it takes a while to run first i thought about making the bridge uh, five instead of four and put mine tracks in the middle and have some form of a mine track booster blah 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 but i didn't want to mess up the theme too much it would just would look weird i think so probably i'm gonna put maybe some mine tracks here just for quick uh, traveling times here between my spawn and back to my base so here's my spawn i spawn somewhere around here can't remember exactly but i lighted up the area with torches and stuff in case i die i don't want mobs here ganking me the second i spawn i don't think that would happen but you know you can you can never be too safe so i did like that and there's the little island which my old bridge stopped on before there's always loot lying around here because the stupid critters keep jumping into the fire and dying. I, I need to map out some form of a fire trap in my head. Question is, if I if I throw this into the fire, will it disappear? Uh, I think it burned up. It looked like it caught fire, so a fire trap might not be good. I've been thinking about making a lava trap as well, but there wouldn't be any loot from a lava trap if we all burn up. 
So the point to making a lava trap is just more for fun, not for, you know, like a loot machine. Like my moat is kind of a loot machine. It drowns the mobs and it doesn't destroy the loot that they drop and they all go down with the current and yeah, I can collect them in the bottom of the outer part of my base. As you can see, my uh, church-like building is still here. I've also added... Uh, some people posted that I asked for down in the block museum. Some people added that I was missing the ores. And as far as I know, without using hacks or anything, you can't uh, reproduce the coal block or the diamond block because it produces a different kind of loot. But you can reproduce the iron block here and the gold block here. Those two are possible as when you collect these, you get the same block and you can just put it out again. Like this, here, I did here in the wall. So there's two more to the block museum added now. Gold and iron and everything else that I showed you last episode or the episode before that, I can't remember. So everything's added here. So I'm still missing uh, the lapis uh, ore and block and uh, blue dice, etc. that I get from that. Which I'm hoping to find with the next string of episodes where I go, go exploring. Uh, not much has changed here. I haven't added anything else new. I think I've basically renovated the towers or the one tower and the passageway. I moved the bridge, which was a complete hassle because of the water currents. If you remove the blocks, the water won't regenerate. It just flows instead, and it didn't fill up perfectly fine. So I had to use buckets of water and making infinite wells and filling up all the holes that uh, the old bridge created when I removed it. So you can still see here there's streams everywhere now but at least it's flat again. Before it was one block deep in the middle of the ocean all of a sudden there was just one block of water missing so I had to replace all that which was quite a hassle and it kind of irritated me that it took almost an hour just to dislodge and dismember the old bridge just to put up the new one that also took an hour to build uh, and so much resources and tools went wasted there just for renovating. Same with the towers, it took take ages to grind down all the cobblestone to replace it with half steps and all the resources. Since you lose basically half your materials when you convert stone to half steps, you have to use twice the materials. So the stone that the tower was built in that I recovered when I destroyed it only, you know, lasted half the tower. So I had to mine all the other stone to make the tower complete again. Same with the passageway, you lose 50% of your resources when you convert it to half steps or something along that lines. Let's see, if you use 4 stacks of 64 stone, you get 4 stacks of 64 half steps, so that's the exact same number. Problem is though, you need 2 half steps per block, so basically 50% goes bye bye. I saw a zombie in here, I'm gonna kill him. What are you doing in my base? Get out of my base! How did you spawn in here? There's, there's a torch room downstairs. It's the brightest area of the whole, my whole base. How did you get in here? You bastard zombie. Uh, he got pooned. What a noob. You're a noob zombie. I even put torches on top of the trees because mobs kept spawning on there. <laughs> on top of the tree. As you can see... Uh, go take a look. Yeah, you can see the flame there. And there's a torch on that other tree as well. It still keeps spawning somewhere in here. I'm still confused how I maybe it's up here somewhere. It's not properly lit up yet But I'm not sure where they're coming from, but I do believe that's it for this episode. That's the renovation Project I'm, I have going on and the next the next bit is to get rid of this tower and replace it with half steps yet again and so much resources I'm gonna need to do that but I really like the look of the tower compared to this old rusty piece of crap, honestly. It looks so shitty compared to the half steps. I don't want cobblestone in my base anymore. Go away, cobblestone. You are obsolete! Go away, cows. Yeah, yeah. I hear ya. Moo. Stop spawning around my base already. Stupid zombies. Why don't I end this video? I don't know. I just wanna kill zombies. Here, hey, hey zombie. What? 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 <laughs> How do you get up there? 
Oh, you are so easy to kill. And yes, I'm playing on hard. I always play on hard, even when I do constructions, etc. So I got, I guess I got used to all the mobs. I've been running around outside when I've been uh, terraforming all the ground ev everywhere. Yeah, that's a, uh, something I've also put a lot of effort into, is renovating this hill. As I said before in the video, to make the tower look like it's coming out of the hill, it's not standing on top of the hill. It looks better now, I think. And I've been renovating on top of this tunnel here, all this dirt. I've I, I placed all this dirt and this hill looks better now, it just looks more natural or more smooth at least. And same down here, all this dirt here has been added. And also I'm in progress down here. All this was sand and stone before. So all this stone is going to get removed and replaced with dirt and grass instead. Because I like the green. I like this contrast here from the green grass to the wooden planks to the half steps. So that's also taking a lot of time renovating stuff. So, but when that tower is done, the last cobblestone tower is renovated and done and all this ground and the hills here have been replaced with dirt. I'm gonna be done with at least stage one of my renovation of home base project and I'm just gonna leave it, you know, and focus on new projects, more exploration and some other stuff. And next episode, I wanna go this way, over here, past that torch there. That's the outline of my base at the moment, and as you can see, there's like a thousand monsters spawning around there. Damn you creepers. The only things that have killed me so far I think are creepers. When I, when you get jumped by a creeper it's like 50-50 chance of live or die. But yeah, there's a lot of mobs out here in the wilderness. So I'm gonna start traveling by day and whenever it goes night I'm gonna dig myself into a mountain or something, a hill and I'm gonna bring a bed with me so I can travel even faster. I just sleep and get off the bed and dismantle it and keep on going as far as I can go when I start seeing the new tree types, uh, pine tree which is a bit of a darker wood and there's birch tree which is the white with the black dots and hopefully then I'll start finding some cave systems and I can find that blue ore, the lapis ore, which I'm really interested in at the moment. I can't find it here due to this world being so old. That's a problem for me right now, since uh, that was added in the Halloween update, I think, with the uh, biomes and some other stuff. It means I can't find it in areas I've already explored, because it's already been generated, that world. And that's an old world generation, so all the new stuff aren't there. But yeah, uh, I said it was going to be a short episode and now it feels like I've been talking for like 20 minutes or something. So I'll see you guys for the next episode. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry for not updating as much as, uh, as, uh, as you want me to update. But I'm just running out of time and running out of ideas. And you know, there's a lot of hassle with all the resource gathering, etc. I don't spawn anything. I gather everything by hand. I'm not using any bots or anything. So it's taking a lot of time, so I'm sorry. I apologize about that, but at least you have something to watch now, tonight. And uh, maybe Friday or so, hopefully, I can put up a string of maybe two, three episodes where I go exploring, finding stuff. So uh, you got something to look forward to, so I'll see you guys then.